Fancy. Dave is dead. I made this game for Dave's birthday, and one day, don't get me wrong, I had some template stuff to work with, but I made it in seven hours, um, because I got the idea last minute, like, hey, it's Dave's birthday today. I think I'll make a game for him. And I was like three and a half, four hours into making this thing, and then I was just like, you know, I gotta finish it. I didn't want to, but I was like, <laughs> I gotta do it. So anyway, Dave is dead. Look at these options. Oh my god, dude. Oh my god. Oh my. I'm a. I'm a god. I'm just saying. Oh my. Oh my, dude. I'm just okay. So yeah, all my future games gonna have this. By the way, it's like a little sneak peek. Um, this menu. I hope you're gonna get uh, get used to seeing it because you're gonna see it a lot. Um, maybe change colors every once in a while, but yeah, this this is like the new standard in. Jayski being games menus like I'm, I'm so proud of these <laughs> options. You have no idea. Anyway, let's get into the game um, Starting new game a little bit. It does not always ask this I've played this on my PC before and what happens is if you hit continue um, Or if you hit new game, it won't ask you that and it'll just create a save file because it's a template guys So anyway, I'm like over explaining the game itself. Let's get into the game. So this game is about I can't leave yet. I still haven't stole all Dave's ideas. Me stealing Dave's ideas. As you guys all know, I do. So basically one down, ten to go, probably. Every single time Nine more, I think. You pick up one of Dave's ideas, another Dave spawns. Wow, eight more ideas to steal. So this game is basically a giant Easter egg game. Now this is not the same build that I made for Dave. Um when I uh, sent it to him. Game is bad. Um, oh, man. the game that I made for Dave, ideas. bonus points if you know this, <clears throat> has a game in it that Dave Six. unreleased. He, Dave oh, did not release. Um, Five. that he will never release. And I'm not even going to say why. Um, but yeah, if you know, you know, it's one of those things. Alright. It's one of those if you know, you know type situations. So anyway, um... Dave is dead, baby. Four more ideas. Um, pretty easy. Oh, um, there's one Easter egg. Shouldn't guys on. know I love hiding Easter eggs behind walls? Um, two. <laughs> Yay! Howdy, howdy, yeah, it's back there. Howdy, howdy, howdy. I died. Okay, that's fine. I, I I had more that I wanted to explain to you guys. I want to show you that though. So before we collect any of Dave's ideas. We're gonna go over what they all are first of all. Okay, so I know I just kind of like ran through and howdy, howdy, immediately howdy, 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 found howdy, a Dave. Howdy, 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 so he always howdy. spawns in that corner. Um, he goes to random patrol points around the map, and uh, this is where he spawns. He spawns back here, so you don't actually ever see him spawn. And it says, LL, this is where Dave spawns. You better get the fuck out. See, this is... I've never seen anybody find this. So I figure, like, when I did my my little death commentary let's play video thing, I'd show you guys. <gasps> oh, I thought it was the one way. I was like, oh my god, am I trapped? <laughs> By the way, jets are flying over my house like crazy. So, one But yeah, down, see? Ten to go, probably. Yeah, there he goes. Going to wherever he's going. <laughs> so that was Bunky. You guys know Bunky. Um, another feature I don't, I don't think I've seen people use in this game. Oh, Dracula's Castle. This is the one that was originally the game that is unreleased. If you guys haven't played Dracula's Castle, you should. It's a treat. Dave, it's the it's the game of Dave's that Dave doesn't like. Um, oh, Strange Terror from Beyond the Stars, very good. More ideas to steal. But anyway, a mechanic I see people not using when they play through this game so far is you can actually hide behind this stuff. Like Dave can't see you. Like AI cannot see through this stuff. Yeah, Shopping Nightmare Remastered. Oh, man, Dave has so many ideas. Not Shopping oh, Nightmare seven too. Left. Seven more to go. So another thing that this game kind of pioneers in that I want to do for my future games and got Mr. Cressy requires Souls of the Damned. Six. Inspiration for the tilty tilty in this game. I try to take little things from all Dave's games and put them in this game. But yeah, um, howdy, 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 hang on, howdy, 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 break these howdy, dudes' ankles howdy, real quick. Howdy, 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 howdy. Oh, what was I saying? I was saying something. Um, I don't remember. I was saying something important though. 
It's going over some crap. Uh, Nosferatu's Bye. Lair of Doom. Uh, Dave Games, blah, blah, blah. I don't know, honestly. Uh, they, they are pretty much blind. Whales for Freedom. Four more ideas. Very good. You know, 8-Bit Ryan voice acts as the main character in that game. Very cool. And you got the the Three trilogy. I can go the first trilogy bundle. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so you notice my character is saying how many there is left to collect, right? After after each one that you find. I'm trying... This is kind of pioneering a new thing that I want to do in my games where I'm using as little to pretty much zero um ui in my games like i i, I want to try to stop using ui altogether if possible because it i feel like it's just a big thing for me lately has been immersion and like breaking immersion in games or i guess not breaking immersion in games and um this is danger land but i'm gonna go this way anyway tunky two classic <laughs> yay um let's go down here and grab Strange Terror one from the Deep. Left and I can get out of here. Arguably one of Dave's best games. And then with the last one, Our Savior, Recorn Culted. Um probably my favorite game by Dave. But yeah, anyway, um This game's like pioneering the whole idea that I'm I'm not gonna be using UI anymore. So no more like listing on the screen, no more like I'm gonna try to stay away from crosshairs the best I can. I'm gonna try to use this mechanic to where like it's not in this game because you don't actually interact with anything. But when you get near something you can interact, your hands, you see my hands there, they like go up. And it like kinda helps to see that. Are you coming to me? But yeah, see, they can't see. It's pretty sweet. So anyway, let's grab our savior. Alright, let's find the exit. Got Let's get out of here. Idea. I stole, stole them all from Dave shamelessly. They're mine, mine now. now. <laughs> Good. Good. All right, cool. So all the voice lines for Dave were actually ripped from like Dave's YouTube videos. <laughs> it's really funny. Um, bonus points if you know what lines come from what. We actually didn't get too many like bonus lines from Dave while we were playing through that time. So I'm going to play through again. Oh, just let us hit. Yeah, we just hit continue. I'm going to play through again. I'm going to try to spawn as many days as possible. One down, ten to go. And just kind of let them cycle through. I think there's like five different voice lines that he can do. Nine more, I think. And they're all from different Dave videos. Wow, eight more ideas. I mean, a couple steal. might be like from the same videos, but... Um, anyway, uh, this game's really, really easy once you learn the maze layout. And um, I purposefully made this maze to not have any dead ends. There are no dead ends. Like if oh, man. there are dead ends, but they're not like they're not true dead ends, you know. Maybe one day I'll make a game. Maybe one day he'll make a game. That's out of context, Dave, because he actually that was that was not five. That was not the end of that sentence. All right, well, there's three voice lines right there. But yeah, uh, most of these voice lines are like taken out of context. Like I cut what he was saying early with my editing skills. Oh yeah, baby. I got another jet coming through. I'm so. In case you don't know how the voice lines work, every Dave that spawns has a timer that has a chance to play a voice line. So the more Daves, the more chance that there's like overlapping audio, which makes it really chaotic the further you get into the game. It's kind of like a natural thing that happens. Three more than I can go home. Yeah. All right. Maybe one day I'll make a game. Uh, yeah. Game, game is bad. Yeah, they're game they're blind. Two. Easy. It is easy. Two more. One idea left. Yeah. That I can get out of We're here. about to beat it again, dude. See, I told you this game is easy. But yeah, I think I right, I think I apologize like idea. every time I record a video. I stole a stole them all from Dave. I'm just gonna go. I'm in a corner here. <laughs> it's tough, man. Oh god. I might die here. It's a big chance I die here. Nope. <laughs> Beat it again, yeah. <laughs> anyway, 
This game is pretty easy, but you gotta know the maze. The maze has no dead ends. Good. <laughs> it's pretty easy to get around once you learn it. Um, everything pretty much looks the same, but it was made in seven hours. You know, like I, I pretty much threw this map together and I made it intentionally to piss Dave off. So that's why a new Dave spawns every single item you pick up, every single idea that you pick up, a new Dave spawns. Um, it's supposed to be really chaotic, really difficult, but the fact that they're blind makes it a lot easier. Um, Dave beat it in like three tries. <laughs> so I was like, okay, well, I guess it's good to release to the public. So I changed a few things, changed some voice lines. Um, I polished a few things in the game itself. It used to look a lot more dull. And um, yeah, pretty cool. And this this main menu music, I actually, I've had on my PC for a while. I was just kind of dabbling in FL Studio and made it. You know how you, you sometimes doodle in music making programs. But anyway, yeah, I, I apologize for the Jets. They, they, they're they on, they're, they're, they're going crazy today. I don't know what's going on. But anyway, thanks for watching. That was... Dave is dead. I figured I'd play it. And um, I want to do more of these developer commentaries pretty soon because I have a lot of games I haven't played on the channel yet. But yeah, thanks for watching. You guys are awesome. I love you.